Alright, what is going on guys? My name is DDoc and today I'm bringing you a brand new video. Just real quick before we start this video, thank you for the support on my speed art and also yesterday's video, or actually not yesterday's, uh, Friday's video. Really appreciate it. Um, some more news and stuff will come up this week on how the channel is going to be run and uh, daily uploading, if that's going to be a thing. Um, I don't know yet. But anyways, this is not what this video is for. So, you clicked on this video for one reason and one reason only, and that is to get Adobe products for free. Now, I have a big risk running this on my channel because I can actually get copyrighted for this and a bunch of other things. So, this video might actually get taken down a few hours, days, or even months after it's uploaded. I'm hoping it won't because this is actually really cool and something that's easy to do so you can get free Adobe products. So, anyways, this whole deal... To begin with it, you have to go and get an account on Adobe.com. Uh, so first off, number one, go get an account, make your account, and then also download the uh, Adobe Cloud, Creative Cloud. That way you can have this menu and all that. Now after you do those two things, and if you guys want to pause the video while you do this, don't worry, you can pause the video and all that. But anyways, the next step to this process is you have to download the ones that you want. So for me, it's Photoshop, Illustrator, uh, Experience, Design, Premiere Pro, After Effects, Character Animation, all this and that. And some of them are actually kind of, you have to do like Media Encoder, you, Media Encoder, you actually have to download no matter what I think. But uh, you can install all of these and all that. The only problem is when you normally install them, they cost, you know, hundreds of dollars every year. Well, this is a workaround to that. So, when you normally download it, you'll actually start a trial, which any none of my trials are actually uh, taken up right now, but I will be able to change the trial days on this, so don't worry. So, anyways, I have two days left remaining on this trial for Photoshop, and uh, what I'm going to try to do, and sometimes this works, sometimes it doesn't. If it doesn't, you just have to go back into the coding and just rechain something, which I'm going to show you the file and everything. It's really simple. It looks complicated when you first start, but it becomes um, very, it becomes habit after a while. I've been using this for about four or five months now. Um, thankfully, I've known, well, I've known about it for four or five months, and I haven't been able to actually do it until I got my new PC. So I've been doing this for about two, a month or two now. So anyways, we're going to go and try to restart my Photoshop CC uh, trial because normally you have a trial and all this really is is just restarting the trial over and over and over again. That way you have it for free because with Adobe, they give you trials, but it's the full um, program. And the reason they do that is because they don't want you to have a snippet of the program and then try to get, you know, try to go off of that. They would never get any buyers for the programs because there would be so little they could do with them maybe um, depending on how they did but there would be so little of the program that they wouldn't get the full thing of it and they wouldn't trust it so anyways enough of the mumbling let's get right into it so you're gonna go into your file program files and all that and you're gonna go to your windows computer th uh, your windows drive basically now you're gonna click on your program files and you're gonna try to look for a file that says Adobe most likely everything is going to be in there like I have After Effects, character, everything. The one I want is Photoshop and the thing is you actually have to, with Illustrator you have to search for it a little bit. I'll just show you real quick. It's in the supporting files, contents, windows, AMT, and down in applications. But anyways, so we're going to go back, go to Adobe. Now you're going to click on Photoshop and you're going to look for a file that then again says AMT. After you do that, you're going to scroll all the way down until you see another file that says application. Not the application.sif, but just the regular application. Every single one that I've done this on so far has worked. And I'll even tell you guys after this how to fix it if it doesn't. Because sometimes it does get a little messed up. And for whatever reason, it doesn't restart the program or the trial. I mean, so, anyways, you're going to right click on that. And you're going to go down here where it says open with. And you're going to open it with the notepad. Now, you're going to see all this coding, and don't let it overwhelm you. It's not that big of a deal. It's just something that it's it's the coding. And unless you know how to code, don't worry about 
anything on here you're just gonna want to go over here to where it says trial serial number and you're gonna see all these numbers right here and the only thing you have to do is delete a number and replace it with another then you go to file save and you're done now you click out of that now I would keep this open just in case it doesn't work now you're probably saying DDoc the Photoshop thing still says it only has two days remaining yes what you have to do is you just have to click over and kind of let Creative Cloud restart and see it says restart the trial again I'll start the trial again and it should give me my seven day trial once more yep there it is now sometimes this doesn't always work and for whatever reason these um, things still go back to the two days or they don't even restart the trial in total now for those because I've had a lot of trouble with Illustrator with that but anyways to fix that all you have to do is go here and uninstall reinstall and it should restart the program uh, the trial I don't know why I keep saying program but yeah it should restart the program there you go again but anyways if you have that problem where it doesn't uh, where it doesn't restart the trial all you have to do is go here press uninstall no or yes keep my preferences it doesn't matter because you're just gonna go back in and reinstall it again and if you did it before and it didn't restart the trial as soon as you download it again it should just say start trial and you should get another seven days now you don't always have to do that but I've had to do with that with illustrator more than anything because it kind of gets a little funky here and there so anyways guys I hope you did enjoy if you guys could please get this video to 50 likes and I'm saying this a lot because this is a lot more than what I normally ask for I normally ask for 10 and I barely ever get that but I'm just asking for 50 because this is a big deal and most likely this video is not going to stay up long on my channel and this could cost me my channel so anyways if you guys could please subscribe like comment and I'll probably do more videos like this if you guys do like let me know in the comments below if this helped you and uh, let me know how you guys think this is and if it works for you. Anyways, guys, that is it, and I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Peace.